The moment a scene I've been dreaming about becomes a reality always amazes me. So many variables had to line up perfectly for that one moment to occur, and the possibility of capturing another one is what gets me out of bed every morning. I feel the same level of anticipation now as I did when I was eight, borrowing my mom's camera and convincing my parents to take me out searching for animals. When people see an image, they're seeing the instant when everything came together, not the countless times that they didn't. Persistence in the field is essential because some pictures can take hours, days, or even weeks of waiting to get. I go out with a specific shot in mind, a certain species, or animal behavior I want to document. But I never really know what a given day will hold. I might find myself photographing something else entirely. It's come to be about much more than just getting a shot. So many things in our lives foster a sense of immediacy, this kind of quick fix mentality. But to photograph wildlife, you have to leave that mindset at the door. It's about looking, listening, and waiting. I know my time will be rewarded. It might not be today or in the way I expect, but here, time, though it may be excessively spent, is never wasted. When I'm out here, I get to step into a world where the chaos, distractions, and anxieties that fill everyday life are no longer relevant. I am wrapped up in the here and now, only concerned with what is around me, focused on the sounds, the smells, the motion, connected to the world in a way that reorients my life and puts things into perspective. I put a lot of effort into encounters that may only last a minute for the opportunity to bridge the gap between their world and ours. These moments have a fleeting and addictive quality. I'm inescapably drawn to the wonder they awaken. And the second they've passed, I find myself in pursuit of another. <laughs> 